Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I want to do a first impression and review on Peter Thomas Roth's CC Cream. Um, and it's broad spectrum, it has SPF 30, it's a complexion corrector, it says it's anti-aging, sunscreen complexion corrector, and tint in one. It helps to protect, brighten, and moisturize the skin. Let me go ahead and apply it right now. I'm only going to take a little bit at a time. And I'm going to work from the middle of my face outwards. So I'm just going to apply this like a moisturizer and spread it all over my face first by patting it and not really rubbing it into my skin. It's not tacky, it doesn't feel tacky like some BB creams do. It still feels really light. I feel a bit of moisture, but not like a moisturizer. I'm just gonna go in and press it where I think I need a little bit more coverage. For some dark spots along that side of the cheek and this side of the cheek and just the remainder around my nose where it's red. I chose a CC cream because I do have dark spots and I just know that, you know, genetically my mom has dark spots on her skin and they progressed as she aged and um, you know I'm getting up there <laughs> so I have uh, started developing them they look like freckles right now but I just know that they're going to become what they are on her um, so I wanted CC cream CC creams are like vitamin C they brighten up the skin they brighten up dark spots especially so I'm trying to do everything I can to protect and preserve what I have right now as I'm still young um, so anyways I really like how this evened out my skin I think it's a pretty good match I am light um, but but it's melted into my skin pretty evenly <clears throat> so light to medium even though I think this is like a lot darker than what I think light to medium should be um, if you're like what am I I'm probably Mac NC 25 NC 30 um, then this might work on you it's still sheer still looks like skin still looks very natural so I'm going to go ahead and complete my face the time right now is 10.50. So it's 10.50 and I'm going to work today. So we'll just see how this holds up and I'll update you throughout the day. Okay, bye. Hey everyone, so I just got to work. It is, time is 2.19. I think that this is holding up pretty well. I did powder my nose because I get really oily um, on that area. So that's really the only place that I powdered. Other than that, um, I think it's held up pretty well for the few hours that I've had it on. It, I've been out running errands too. I with my girlfriend. Um, I dropped off my husband's phone at his work. So I've been in the car all day. I've been outside and... You know, I think it's held up pretty well, especially considering that it's 81, 82 degrees outside. So it's not that bad, but it is humid here. And um, I really like how it's holding up. It, it feels like um, none of it has disappeared around any areas. I still like the coverage. It still feels like skin and it doesn't feel uh, too oily. It does, I mean, it's getting there on my nose a little bit, but not so much yet so I'll update you on my break and I'll see you guys later bye hey everyone welcome back the time is currently 7 13 can you guys see that so it's 7 13 and this is how my face is doing so far <laughs> that was not good lighting <laughs> 
my nose is so oily right now I have not even touched it I need to take a blotting sheet to it because even when the Sun hits it like that look it's gleaming oh my nose is my problem area but everywhere else like it doesn't look bad at all it doesn't look like I am an oily oil slick like an oil slick mess so I like that I always expect to get oily on my nose nothing no product has completely matted it out for the whole day so I expect that it's going to be like that and um, but for everything else um, my forehead isn't shiny at all see my forehead no not shiny at all but my nose is my chin not so much um, my cheeks not so much either and um, so I really like this found this uh, CC cream it's held up I feel like I'm still wearing it it hasn't disappeared throughout the day my face it still feels light it doesn't feel like I'm wearing anything at all <clears throat> which is what I think CC creams are supposed to be doing anyway and um, I'm not overly oily so yeah my skin is um, normal to oily and it leans very oily in the summertime so yeah that's what it is and um, I'm actually doing a two-in-one and I'm going to go ahead and review this dry shampoo <laughs> too after this so this one is really good I give it two thumbs up Peter Thomas Roth your CC cream is awesome the only downside is that you have two shades they actually I stand corrected they have four shades they have one in light medium which is the one that I had which is the one that I have on right now they have porcelain beige for fair complexions with neutral undertones so if you're lighter than me then that probably works neutral tones kind of, sometimes they le lean a little bit pinker and then they have medium tan which is too dark for me the medium tan for medium olive and medium tan skin tones and then they have mocha with neutral undertones for dark skin tones so that's good <clears throat> although they only have four that's still limited to certain like undertones and oh I really like this one I'm glad that it comes in four and not two shades <laughs> I stand corrected they might have added that later on because I don't think that I saw that before so anyways I really really like it I think that you should pick it up you should play around with it when you're at Sephora or wherever they sell Peter Thomas Roth because I really think that you would enjoy it anyways yeah I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next review bye